TIFU by ignoring my black iris eye problem for years. So I was born with dark brown eyes. And in my younger pictures, you can see that they are brown if the flash is really in them but otherwise they look black. In high school we were doing genetic experiments and stuff. Don't remember the specifics. But part of it included taking up close pictures of our eyes with flashlight on. I remember my eyes looking completely black. And even my teacher was a bit confused since black eyes don't exist I never really thought of it. Again after that. Why didn't I ever think to get it looked at? I even have really bad symptoms and stuff and still ignored it. Anyway. Fast forward to now and I'm studying abroad and I get an eye test here since I can't afford to get them in the US. They were offering them for free at the university and were gonna give us up close pictures of our eyes. My friends thought it would be fun and I could kinda prove that my eyes are super dark. They are very confused because my pupils are very very dilated and not reacting to light. There's a thin outer layer of dark dark brown so that's how they know. I have like 5 appointments to go to after Christmas so we'll see how that goes. They think it was caused from one of the concussions I got when I was young lol. They think I might have permanent damage that's gotten really bad. I thought I just had an astigmatism that was getting worse and chronic headaches. There's supposed to be precautions and safety wear for PPL with pupils like this. TLDR. I thought I just had black eyes. But my pupils are actually likely permanently blown likely from childhood head trauma. I assume one of those appointments are an MRI. Get to an ophthalmologist or a neurologist ASAP. Don't forget to post an update we hear like those. Also that's rather sad that you couldn't afford to get an eye exam before. This isn't your FU. This is your parents. Regular eye exams are part of normal medical care. Not to mention well child checkups with a pediatrician. Your parents failed to provide you with basic care here. Ah. There is a British comedian called David Mitchell who has something very similar. It's called aniridia. Basically his irises never develop properly. If that turns out to be what you have it is a fault in a specific gene that caused it and it occurs. In 1 in 50,000 to 100,000 newborns. Genetic diseases of the eye interest me as I also have one. A fault in the EFEMP1 gene called Doin Honeycomb Retinal Dystrophy. There's less than 2,000 known sufferers. You've been walking around looking like a horror movie this entire time. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.